What's going on everybody, Jesse here. Today I'm gonna show you how you can take a Python script and get it up on the cloud and generate a GUI around it uh, to make it usable by others. I write scripts all the time and I have a million of them sitting on my local laptop. Problem is if I want somebody else to be able to use those scripts, particularly if they're less technical, uh, a lot of work goes into that and I'm gonna show you how to do it super quickly. So the script I'm gonna be demoing this with today is just a little script I threw together in Python uh, it's called movie.py and it asked me to enter in a movie name so I type in the matrix or something else and it prints back out to me the plot of the movie very simple I'm using an AVI, a API called OMDB and I am doing the API through a third-party library called requests so what WayScript is gonna allow me to do is very very rapidly take that same script and generate a GUI on the cloud around it so that I can enter in any movie name that I want and run the script and get the result. So let me show you how this works. So to start, I am going to create a script that I call MoviePop. Awesome. So now we are in the WayScript dev environment and First thing I'm going to do is just grab the Python module and I'm going to drag that into my program and my Python shell appears here. So I'm just going to grab my script and copy and paste it in. Awesome. So in the script itself, I was using the input function uh, in Python to ask a user to enter a movie name. Uh, but in order to get this working, I'm going to do something slightly different. So above my Python script, I'm going to create a variable by the same name. And for now, just assign a default value of the matrix to it and press enter. Now that variable has been created. And because I actually wanted want this variable to appear on the dashboard, I am just going to elect to show it on the dashboard. Great. Um, so now I'm going to go back into my Python script. Cool. So now I'm back in here and what I can do is in the input section, I can grab that movie name variable that we created and replace this input with calling inputs, which is a dictionary and just feeding in the name of the variable. I can do this with more variables if I wanted to input more things from the user, but just for this example, this one. And then at the end, instead of printing the result, movie plot I'm going to just comment this out and replace it with assigning that movie plot variable to an output um, called movie plot I can preview my script running and the output comes and I uh, so just as a side note I know that this works because I can see the movie plot variable is here and I can see um, the preview of the result so very similar to before I'm just going to expose this to show in the dashboard so now I can return to the dashboard. And here it is, my script is now exists here. So as we said before, I can go and take any movie and input it and just press run and the program runs and the result appears. Also, I can go into settings and press the share button. And then I can type in the email of anybody that I want and it will share the script with them. So a less technical person who I want to share this with can just use the dashboard or if I have somebody who wants to mess with it they will get the full program and can go in and edit it themselves. So that's it. This is how you can very rapidly build and put a Python script up on the cloud and generate a GUI interface around it and then can seamlessly share those scripts with others. Uh, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more videos.